was funny. I showed people where I was like, I'm taking this bitch down. I was just like, I'm going to be cool with her for hell long. I'm going to take her down. And when I take her down, I'm taking her down raw. This is the thing. I don't use condoms. My hoes don't use condoms. They do it the tricks. But like when you find somebody and predator prey them down, like happy hour drinks, dinner, dessert, little ice cream hour, whatever the fuck. And I'm hunting you down. I'm not hunting you down to put no condom on, bitch. I already ran your background. The whole day and weekend I'm spending with you, your background is being ran with these conversations and how you move and clean yourself and under your nails and how your breath smell and everything. I'm checking your credit, bitch. Like, this is your credit check. You hanging with me. I'm running your shit. You feel me? So when we got down to the point, we got to the point of when we were going to do that after kissing and dry humping for an hour and a half in the presidential suite, I'm like, she's like, where? she's like, you got a condom. I'm like, that's a deal breaker for me. So we have to continue to do raw activities. What is the only other raw activity you can do besides kissing and dry humping? Oh, sucking the dick and eating the pussy. She's like, yo, I can't do that, yo, because like, I got a situation, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, nah, it's cool. Just hold it. You feel me like a QP. microphone. QP. I, I, it, it, when, when, I, I, I could never. <laughs> I learned that situation once and never went down that road again. I could never dry hump for that long, my nigga. Like that, that, was, just, that was, would just be pissed. That would just piss me off. Like, it, was I, bit, it was painful, but it was a point because I needed to imprint something in her mind. So like that whole time, me as a grown man, that's like the slow dance in high school when I already been fucking my girlfriend in between periods. And I don't mean the menstrual cycle. I mean in between classes, right? Because that's how classy she was. You feel me? She tried and true. Oh, and she, tried, she was tried and true and see. You feel me? Like that was her. So it's just like being able to let her feel what time it was, especially coming off the truth, Watson. Now you with Sherlock Holmes. So like you and Sherlock, the pipe game. Oh, right? The pipe game different. Plus it was like for a girl to be like where the condom at, like, you know, that already is like I <sighs> It was in my jeans. Then, um, feel me? She was like, yeah, Jimmy. I'm like, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing that. And I kept trying to explain to her, me, I started trying to explain to her, me being a pimp, my hoes are cleaner than your girlfriends, right? And it's like, like your cousin, Nader Redbone, my bitches are cleaner than her because my bitches come back smelling like latex and lubricants and things like your bitch come back smelling like cum and semen and these things and that shit is the difference between water, right? And and the scent of corroded semen, right? And and the matter of, you know, all the juices. Cause a lot of girls, after you pipe them down and you like make kind of make love to them a little bit. That's when they bust more than one orgasm. The bitch think you made love to them when they bust more than one orgasm. Oh, you made love to me. Uh... That bitch, <laughs> the bitch you made love to me. The bitch you yeah. up to is gonna lay up with you. She's not gonna hop up and get in the shower. The bitch that you fucked and she came once or didn't come, she's gonna get right up and get in the shower. Jazz didn't come, right? Cool. She got right up, called Ash Cash or Ash Cat. I can't remember. These bitches got the same Ash Cash. Both yeah, yeah, okay, cool. Right. Called her, told her about how she walked out, and then she immediately you took hear what a, a, right I, immediately, I immediately sent her what? A, a, a $115 Uber back to whatever part of New York she's from, from, from Long Island. So, I mean, they didn't get those things didn't even really run. I had to like order one to a shorter distance and then the driver had to pull up. Then I had to order it to the further distance and then pay him cash. Cause that's what you have to do when you move a bitch way outside of a borough. You feel me? No shower though. No shower. Just get up and go. Yeah. No, nah, she had to that's get up and go. Nah, I'm not taking a shower with the nigga that couldn't give me no O either. Like, nigga, you, this is it. You had a chance and you failed. I have to go and tell Nada Redbone what happened. You feel me? And, you know, go from there and ask why she's busting hella nuts and I'm not busting any. Feel me? That's it. So shout, shout out Jazz the Rapper. You feel me? How about them apples? <laughs>